All right, so in this video, we're going to use ultrasound to assess for musculoskeletal structures, specifically the skin, the muscles, and nerves, and kind of how to differentiate between those. So depending, we're just going to use the, this patient's forearm as an example, left forearm. So in general, for musculoskeletal ultrasound, you're going to use a linear probe. It has the best resolution. Um, and you put it on musculoskeletal setting. So I'm just going to look at his mid forearm right here and identify some structures. So just going from top to bottom, you see the very top layer is going to be your dermis and your epidermis there. And just posterior to that, you see muscle, some fascial uh, layers there. And in the middle, if you go over here, you see a little pulsating structure. That's actually an artery. You can confirm that with, so with color flow Doppler also. And you see some color flow going through that vessel there. The structure right in the middle of the screen might be hard to see initially, but that is actually the median nerve of this patient. And this is also subjected to anisotropy. As you decrease the angle, you see that the nerve almost disappears. And when I am perpendicular, the nerve reappears um, and looks uh, very apparent there. Another thing you can see with musculoskeletal ultrasound is bones. So here I'm going towards his radius, and that's actually his radial bone right in the middle of the screen there. You see it has a very hyperechoic cortex, and it shadows because it's so dense that ultrasound waves cannot pass through. So that's what the appearance of bone looks like. Okay? So once again, for the musculoskeletal ultrasound, you can see the dermis, epidermis. You can see muscle layers. You can see nerves and as well as bones.